Welcome back, folks, to the Hardcore Minecraft Let's Play. When we last left off, I would built a house. It's right there. The house currently has no one living in it. That's to be expected, because we haven't actually found anyone yet that could live there. Do we actually even have a golden apple? We have potions of poison. That's not going to help me hugely. Well, what we can do is make some potions of weakness soon. Which I do think we need. I think we need fermented spider's eye for that, though. But I'm forgetting how you make fermented spider's eye. Is it with sugar? Hmm. Well, that's alright, because right now we don't even have an apple. Which you need a, to make a golden apple. A golden apple, you use gold nuggets for. Which I've just made. So, without that, we can't even make what I want to make anyway. And just to be efficient, let's go get some more sand. Oh, it is dark, isn't it? Yeesh. Let's get sand from somewhere that's not as... well... deep. Hey! Well, I could safely say that this, uh... settlement is pretty much established. I may be all alone, but here I am. As I am. We'll take some of this sand. No one's gonna miss it. I might miss it later if I choose to expand into this area. However, that's either here nor there. Let's get 16. There we go. Perfect. 16, I can make a lot of the glass vials. What is actually down here right now? Well, there are some, uh... There are some of those. Okay, getting dark. Getting dark. But that's okay, because now that we're actually somewhere where there's a bed, I can actually relax when it's dark and just uh, let the night fly by. In the world of... Oh, I've already been making glass. That's handy. That's very handy, actually. Let's fill these up with water as my last act of the day. More water's just out here anyway, so one, two, three, there we go. Three bottles of water. No, oh, that is not the way to the that's not the way to the bedroom. This is the way. <laughs> that's the way to the battlements, and if I'm sleeping up there, there's something wrong. Daytime! And probably seven million monsters. A spider eye. I am missing something. A spider eye and sugar. I don't think I actually need that, actually. I think I just need the, um, the warts. Oh, 
Because I have multiple of these. Yeah, I have loads. Just replant them. Right. Let's try some alchemy, shall we? I do not remember what I'm doing with this. Right, that actually makes something. So, if memory serves, gunpowder makes a thing a splash um, potion. So, water bottle, that's fine. If this makes a weakness potion, then we're getting somewhere. I think it does. Awkward potion. Okay, it makes awkward potions. We definitely need a fermented spider eye. How we make one, though? I'm sure it used sugar. Hmm. I'm actually going to look this up. Hold on. You also need a brown mushroom. Of which I have many. No wonder I wasn't getting anywhere. Yep. There you are. Fermented spider eye. Yeah. It's been that long since I've done alchemy. Right. Fermented spider eye gets to go in with the awkward potions. You need the awkward potion as the base for most potions. If you don't have nether warts, it's exceptionally difficult for you to make any potion uh, for any decent potions, and it's impossible to make most of them. So, this will then make potions of weakness, which if I were to drink them would reduce my strength. Not a smart plan. However, if I'm to put gunpowder in it, it adds a splash effect, which then makes it a splash potion, or in layman's terms, a grenade. Make a grenade. Do we have any apples? We have no apples at all. Nearly done. Now they are splash potions of weakness. They last for less time, but that's okay. What I need right now is that I need to find a apple. Now, the only way I can get apples, really, is to cut down trees. So there's going to be a bit of a deforestation happening right now. Because I need an apple. So wherever there's a tree, I'm cutting it down. Well, not round here. Round here, though, definitely. Ah, because there's wood here, technically, it thinks there's still a tree. I always find that interesting. Remember when I used the apples to desperately stave off hunger? Remember that? That feels feel like such a long time ago. But it wasn't as long as I thought. This will also give me a nice supply of wood. It's a side effect, but it's not a terrible one. I knew I'd eventually have to look up how to make that fermented spider eye. Okay, chopping down every tree I can physically see in an effort to get a single apple. Once you have two villagers and you make enough doors... Well, that was easy. They're able to breed. So, you only need two. But right now I'd settle for... Hey! Well, I said I would li wouldn't mind to, but... If you're gonna give me two, that works as well. Well, it looks like we need to make a second house. Over here. Ow. Yep. Go 
going to make this one a bit smaller. We need more wood. This is something that can be sorted, though. Now, the problem is, is we need to go out at night to find these um, things that we need, which is not good. Night's pretty dangerous. But you didn't need me to tell you that. You know. Because zombies come out at night. And what I specifically want is a zombie villager. They have a very distinctive look about them. For now, let's craft those apples. Do you not need gold nuggets? Don't tell me they've made it gold bars again. I, why do I get the feeling? Yep, they made it gold bars again. Yeah, they, they, they changed it to golden nuggets a while ago, and then they found out that it was a bit too powerful. So that's probably why they made it back into bars. So this experiment had better work. The problem with um, making a village is that it makes zombie sieges happen. Zombie sieges are horrible. And are basically, hey, we're going to assault your um, your settlement quite often with a large quantity of zombies. I mean, fair enough, it does provide a challenge. Where are my glass panes? I don't have, oh, I only have a few. Okay. I have a lot of glass right there, so that's not a problem either. I'm about to have a lot more. There we go, that should be sufficient. Just need to quickly build this house. Oh, my character seems a bit hungry. Why don't you eat something? Nom nom nom. Is that it? Well, they only gave me one seed. Oh. Yeah, don't do anything silly, by the way, like accidentally eating that golden apple. The golden apple will restore all of your health. But you use nine gold bars to make it. So do not accidentally eat it. It kind of sucks. Unless, of course, you're on a hardcore server and you're about to die. By all means, eat the apple at that point, because being an apple down is one thing, being dead is quite another. So I'm building a second house. Hey, an egg! Thank you. Oh, no chicken. Boo. And that there. Excellent. That works. And it's getting close to night already. I'll soon we get to uh, try and make a zombie, uh, try and make a villager. Try and make a zombie. Zombies are easy to make. I don't need to put any effort into that. They just like appearing. Um, right, there we go. Need to be quick, though. Or else I'm going to be in some bother. Nearly done. These places, these houses have absolutely nothing in them. They don't need anything in them. 
Watch me die here now. Just be blown up by something horrible or be attacked by multiple um, endermen. But no. No, it does not seem like it's going to happen today. There we go. Just need to put a few ones on the top. Like this. And now let's get out of here. I do not want to be caught outside. I don't mind there actually being monsters around. But I don't want them, but I don't want to be outside when they spawn. So there we go. I have two little houses. And let's run inside and hide and see if a zombie decides to come out that is a human zombie. Or a human in the making. Well, we have two more books I can make. Which means, with the third book, I can make a bookshelf. One bookshelf down. A lot to go. I think I need 15 of them. And that's a lot of bookshelves. It's going to take me a good while to sort that out. And I'm going to need to kill a few more cows. I need to breed the cows so I can kill them so I can get their actual stuff. Right, I need that second potion of weakness. I hope I didn't let a creeper in by doing that. Nope. No, I didn't. That's good. Use them in that order. So now, I sit over here, and I wait and see. Oh, to be fair, there aren't many places anymore a monster could actually spawn. Because the island's quite light. However, it's not completely light. I could always go into the dungeon and try and find one there. It's always an idea. Not down there. That's not the dungeon. Yeah, that one's pretty light now, so... More. Uh, anything on that island over there? Hello? Monsters? I actually want you to spawn now! So I can get a villager. You can be avatar taxed. We can call this new new Britannia. No. I'm oh, fine. I'll head down beneath the surface. Do what needs to be done. I don't actually have some food on hand in case I get hit. It's been a while since I've been down in this dungeon. This dungeon of darkness. Is this even the right way? Yes, this is the right way. That's a that's a baby zombie. I don't like baby zombies. I really don't. down here is probably a mistake. I don't really want to be down here right now. Let's head back up. But I do have all the things I need to make a zombie villager when such an opportunity presents itself. Right now, no opportunity is presenting itself, and that's water. I really need to make these stairs. Monsters? No, no monsters at all. Eh. So when we come back, folks, we need to wait for villagers, wait for uh, monsters to spawn, so I can actually fight them, and so I can actually create a village. 
because that's really my next objective at the moment. I could go down into the depth some more, but there's not too much need. Well, actually, if I don't have diamond, there is need. So, we'll be back in a moment. Later!